Hello, here's a quick demo of integration of Azure DevOps with Atlassian and Jira software. So assume we have a project and you want to bring commits and build pipeline to it. So let's say the project name is Leo and has issue key starts with Leo. So let's create quickly an issue key. So before we do it, I will show you how it looks at the end. So you see here commits uh, and as well you see uh, failed builds. Uh, so you don't need to leave Jira to see the result of your uh, continuous integration pipelines. So for this demo, let's create an issue. So let's name it Mover Forward with Azure DevOps for Jira. We have created it and it became jumped in, uh, in progress straight away. Let's see uh, which issue key it has. It has issue key layer 5. Now what we do, we go to commits. We find our repository where we want to do the changes and let's say we want to make some amazing changes in the readme file. So in order to link a change to an issue, your issue, you need to use the issue key as a reference and, ma and make it as part of the commit message. So in this case, as you see, uh, in a few seconds, it will appear in Jira uh, after we send the subscription. So uh, after a couple of seconds, we see that this commit appeared on, on the issue key and you can see the changes. The next quick demo, let's make a branch for this issue, name it layer 5 uh, map. So we come and we decide to remove this unnecessary change and do a commit. We we'll say layer 5 commit. Let's also assume it's also for layer 4. And now we can do a pull request. And in this pull request, we already have title which references the Jira issue key. We create it. We complete it and we merge it. So now after a couple of seconds we will see two commits. Yes, after a few seconds we see the G issue layer 5 has two commits. One is when we did the push and second one is the pull request itself. So we can see all those commits uh, as well as builds which failed due to this unreliable commit. So as you see, this integration simplifies your integration with Azure DevOps and Jira software. Thank you.